What's poppin', man? You already know it's woke the whiskey. I'm just out here chilling. You know what I'm saying? I'm just trying to have a good day. I'm just trying to survive. All these dudes talking about they're the chosen ones, but they ain't the chosen ones. How you gonna call yourself the chosen one when you ain't even got the Bible on the couch right there? <laughs> you ain't got the Bible. What is that on the couch, my nigga? Like, what are you doing right now? So, all this time I've been talking to my peoples and like, dang, why? I be wondering why they be calling yourself the chosen ones. Like, they, they can't be getting out the Bible. They getting it from somewhere else. And that's more proof right there. And y'all still don't get it? <laughs> hey, man, check me out. Let's get to it. Trend Genius, man. Let's go. Anyway, man, with that being said, chosen one, listen, man, listen. Read the miracle power of your mind to activate the law of attraction. I can, and you don't think that you manifesting things fast enough, or you might be in a position right now where you don't, you don't know your purpose. You don't know what's happening in your life. Maybe you're in a position right now where your life is like chaos. You know, everybody pointing fingers at you. You probably don't got the type of money that you really want to have. You just wondering, what is it for you to do? <laughs> Listen, I'm about to. <laughs> This dude got me choking. <laughs> this dude got me weak over here. Hey, check me out, man. Look, so if I'm having a bad time over here trying to figure out how I'm going to pay my bills, how I'm going to pay my car note, how I'm going to pay my phone bill, how I'm going to get here, how I'm going to get there, why is people messing with me? Why is people attacking me? Okay, so think about this. A spiritual war, a physical war. So let's see what this dude got to talk about because... I already know what this is coming to. You know what I'm saying? Let's get it. At my lowest point, I didn't have a purpose. I didn't have a vision. I didn't even know who I was or nothing. I was in an environment that I didn't want to be in. You know, I was I, I was with my girlfriend at the time. We were struggling. It was it was bad. It was bad. Like it's just you know those days, right? Those days where it's like when you call on God, it's like the prayer is just not getting answered, right? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. He said when you call on God, he put his hands in the sky and said, the prayers are not getting answered. How? Duh. If you're not connected to him, how are you going to answer your prayers? <laughs> but this is the thing. What God is these dudes talking about? I'm confused. It's not even the Bible right there. Let's see. Let's, let's go a little bit more, man. Y'all don't get it, huh? A couple days ago when my uncle died, that reminded me of them bad times I was in. Like, I went to... I All right, so look. <laughs> Before he pick up that book, <laughs> I've been at my lowest point. A lot of people died in my life. They've been on YouTube longer than me talking about being woke and being the chosen ones, right? So, all of a sudden... When he decided to read this book at this moment, now he's starting to become awoke. Like, <laughs> this book is helping him become more woke now. How is that to mean you're the chosen one? That's not the Bible. Come on, y'all not listening. This is crazy. This book right here, folks. This book right here that I'm telling you about. This book is what woke me up. Okay? This book, it will. It will. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> He said, this book woke you up. Everybody, you see the book he got? If y'all trying to get woke, don't go watch The Matrix. Don't listen to Jesus. Don't take the red pill. He's telling you to read this book, and all of a sudden, you're going to become, become woke. <laughs> He's usually killing me, though. Set the, it was set the, the life that I'm living right now. This book did. And you know that what they say about books. That's what they put the secrets in, folks, because they know people ain't going to read it. <laughs> they know people some deception. Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. What do you mean people ain't going to read it? People buy books every day. People read books every day. People read books at school. What secrets? There ain't no secrets. Everything's on the internet. Like, <laughs> These dudes be sleep, man. Y'all don't even see it. It's crazy. I'm going to listen to a little bit more before I go, man. Uh, I had to go buy this book again, and this is like my sixth time buying this book I, because I'm always giving it away, or people will always come to my crib and they'll steal it from me because that's how good this book is. People is stealing this book.
from me when they come to hang out with me. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> That's not good. Stealing? People coming to your house to steal when you're the chosen one? And it's okay for somebody to come to your house and steal from you? <laughs> These dudes be capping. Hey, man, check me out. You don't need that book. You need the Bible. That book ain't going to get you nowhere. Open the Bible. I don't need that book to make me manifest anything. God is going to manifest what he want. And whatever he think I need, I'm going to get it. You know what I'm saying? Like, it sucks. Life ain't fair. Hey, check me out, man. Catch, you know what I'm saying? Relax and get to the gyms, man. It's broken. The whiskey and I'm gone.